what you um, what you say to, to Ross there, excuse me, what you say in the chat is so R backslash child free exists. Mm -hmm. Yes. Do you do you remember typing that and sending that? Um, I probably yeah, I probably saw it on like the front page, something like that, of the website, and then and then posted. All right. When you say you saw it on the front page of the website, what what you mean is you saw it on <coughs> the Reddit homepage. Correct. Yeah. Okay. And you put it out there for for the fellows to see. Yep. At two o two in the afternoon. Yep. And you give a little explanation. You say it's the R. Uh, backslash and that's Reddit. Mm -hmm. Atheism of not having kids. Mm -hmm. yep. And um, I mean, you don't subscribe to that philosophy, do you? Of of uh, people never to have children. No, I, no. I was I was making fun of it in that comment. So I was saying because it's ridiculous. The way they go about it is ridiculous. Not, not having kids is a personal decision, but like railing against people who have kids or not. And um, you know what, actually, if you want to go ahead and have a seat, I'll let you sit down. You didn't know you were going to get a workout here, did you? So, you agree that you, um, you found this child free on the uh, face page of Reddit, yep. on the home page of Reddit. Yep. And you put it out there in the chat. Mm -hmm. And did you see what Ross's response was? Yeah, he wasn't for it. He wasn't for it, was he? Nope. In fact, his response was grossness. Yep. You've never, um, you've never heard Ross subscribe to Living Child Free, have you? No. Nope. You've never known him to join any group subscribing to a philosophy of Living Child Free, have you? No. Nope. But within 20 seconds of you putting that out there on the chat, he responded, Grossness. Yep. Okay. 